1982 marked the start of this year's naming list and in that year nothing was retired but Florence came pretty close with that category 4 peak near Atlantic Canada. 1988 came and went with Gilbert ravaging the Yucatan as a category 5 and Joan also making a category 5 landfall in Nicaragua. They were replaced with Gordon and Joyce. In 1994, Keith got the boot as it scared the coastline of North Carolina by jumping from a tropical storm to a Category 2 on approach. It was replaced with Kirk. The new millennium kicked off with the tag team from hell, Michael and Nadine ravaging the Yucatan, the US Gulf Coast and the Caribbean, both as major hurricanes. They were replaced with Manny and Nadia. 2006 saw Florence grow to a monstrous Category 4 and impact the Florida Panhandle still as a major. It was finally replaced with Philomena. 2012 saw Leslie get kicked out when it caused damage still as a tropical Category 1 in Newfoundland. And Alpha got the boot by attacking Jamaica and Cuba as a Category 3 major. Leslie was replaced by Lindsay, with Alpha continuing use when necessary up until 2021. 2018 was a bumper year in terms of activity, starting with Alberto becoming a major and impacting the Mississippi coastline before the official start of the season, Helene becoming a Category 5 on approach before changing its mind again and again and eventually impacting South Carolina still as a major system, and that's not mentioning its extremely long time as a tropical cyclone. Kirk ravaged the Lesser Antilles as a still intensifying major system but then continued its wrath as it reached Category 5 strength and though much weaker, impacted many Caribbean islands and the western Louisiana coastline. Raphael also impacted the Lesser Antilles, but that wasn't enough as it went on to impact the Bahamas and eastern Florida before making its way to Louisiana like Kirk before it. Tony earned its retirement by coming out of nowhere and intensifying to a Category 5 all the while heading towards the Florida Panhandle making landfall at that intensity. Needless to say, they were all retired and replaced with these names. And in the auxiliaries, Heath was discarded for performing loop-the-loops and affecting the island nations of Cuba and Haiti multiple times in 2023. It was replaced by Horus. Meaning that your 2024 Atlantic What Might Have Been naming list looks like this, with the new names Alfonso, Philomena, Hope, Kelvin, Lindsay, Manny, Nadia, Rawl, and Trevor. With Sandy still surviving in 2024, will it survive this year?
become an ultimate fan today.